This was our wedding held at the backyard of our villa in Bali, in Ubud. Bali is the only island in Indonesia that they're actually Hinduists. What made us decide to um, have our wedding there is just the fact that it's small. Well, small in the sense of Indonesian. We had about a hundred guests. <laughs> which is ridiculously small for Indonesia because normally weddings there is like 3,000 people, <laughs> 5,000. Uh, actually, he proposed... I don't actually remember <laughs> Uh, yeah, it's a long story. Yeah, this is true. He proposed many times in Paris, in Bangkok, and in Bali. Because I always told him, just in case you propose, please let me at least have my mascara on or some kind of makeup. I don't want to look ugly for a <laughs> for proposal. So, you know, sometimes he found the right moment, but then it was by the beach and I looked messy and then he refrained himself from asking, but I sort of knew. <laughs> of the Hindu ceremony, the date was chosen by the priestess and the pamanku, the high priest. It was the only good date in the month of August that year. And it means that it's either people get married or people have cremation. <laughs> that day, it was huge cremation and our wedding. <laughs>